This video is for educational purposes only. Do not use these tools for illegal activities. What I wish I knew at the start instead of the end, your phone number is more powerful than you think. It's a skeleton key to your digital life. Today, we're diving into the world of OSINT, open source intelligence, and exposing just how much anyone can learn about you with only your digits. By the end, you'll see your phone number in a whole new light and know how to protect yourself. Let's get started. First up, let's talk about Truecaller, a crowdsourced phone directory that's become a household name in the fight against spam calls and unknown numbers. Every day, millions of people rely on it to identify callers and block unwanted spam, making it a go-to tool for anyone tired of robocalls and telemarketers. But here's the twist. When you install Truecaller, you're often asked to grant access to your entire contact list. This means you're not just protecting yourself, you're also feeding names and numbers from your phone into a massive global database that's constantly growing. Anyone with the app can search for your number and instantly see the name attached to it. Sometimes even quirky nicknames or how others have saved you like Mikey the Mechanic or Sarah from Yoga. For investigators, this is a powerful first breadcrumb. It's a quick way to connect a phone number to a real person, opening up new leads in seconds. But there's a catch. The data isn't always accurate. It can be outdated, wrong, or misleading. You might find yourself listed even if you've never used the app, simply because someone else who had your number uploaded their contacts. Your information can be shared by friends, family, coworkers, basically anyone who has your number saved. And all of this happens without your explicit consent, making privacy a real concern. Using Truecaller is simple. Just type any phone number into the search bar and see what pops up. It's a tool that puts a surprising amount of information at your fingertips. The results can be fast, easy, and sometimes a little unsettling, especially when you realize how much of your own data is out there for anyone to find. Truecaller won't give you home addresses or email addresses, but it's often the starting point for building a digital profile or piecing together someone's identity. The real danger? You're part of this system, whether you like it or not. Even if you're careful, your privacy depends on everyone who has your number. Your privacy is only as strong as your least careful contact. One careless friend can put your information out there for the world to see. So, with Truecaller, the line between convenience and privacy is thinner than ever. Let's see what the next tool can uncover. Moving on. NumLookup is a free reverse phone lookup tool that's become increasingly popular for its simplicity and effectiveness. Unlike many other lookup services that rely mostly on crowdsourced data, NumLookup digs deep into public records and official databases to find information. All you have to do is enter a phone number, hit the search button, and within moments, you might see the owner's full name, their carrier, and even the type of phone line they use. For North American numbers, NumLookup is often more accurate and reliable for official information than apps like Truecaller, which sometimes rely on user submissions that can be outdated or incorrect. However, there are limitations. Most of the time, you'll only get the name for free. If you want more detailed information, like address history or additional contact details, you'll need to pay for premium access. What's truly surprising is just how easy it is to use. Anyone with an internet connection can put a name to a number in just a few seconds, no technical skills required. This convenience comes with a downside. It lowers the barrier for digital stalking, harassment, or even identity theft, making privacy concerns more urgent than ever. Your phone number isn't just a random string of digits anymore. It's a direct key to your real-world identity, connecting your online and offline lives. So while NumLookup can be a useful tool to confirm information or check unknown callers, always remember that it's a double-edged sword that can be used for good or harm. Even something as simple as a wrong text or a leaked number can expose your name and identity. The risks are real, and it's important to stay aware. Let's keep digging. Sync.me takes things up a notch by linking phone numbers to social media profiles. Enter a number and it can pull names, profile pictures, job titles, and even direct links to Facebook or LinkedIn. Suddenly, you have a face, a career, and a window into someone's online life. For investigators, it's a jackpot, connecting the dots automatically. Before, you'd have to search every platform manually. Now Sync.me does it in seconds, but it's invasive. Your public info scattered across the web is now aggregated and tied to your number. 
the walls between your online identities are paper thin. It's a privacy nightmare showing just how exposed we all are. Be careful what you share and where you share it. Next tool. Spy Dialer is clever and undeniably creepy. It's a tool that sits right at the intersection of technology and privacy, raising eyebrows for both its ingenuity and its potential for misuse. With Spy Dialer, you can listen to someone's voicemail greeting without ever making a direct call or revealing your own number. It's like peeking through a digital keyhole. No one knows you're there. The service dials the number from its own servers, connects to the voicemail, records the outgoing message, and then plays it back for you. You never have to risk exposure or awkward questions. This means you can confirm if a number is active, hear the person's actual voice, and sometimes even pick up details like their name, workplace, or other personal info they mention in their greeting. For investigators or researchers, it's a powerful way to verify information when other tools hit a dead end. It can be the missing puzzle piece in a tough case. There's no direct contact, no trace left behind, just passive listening from a distance, making it almost invisible to the person being checked. But this power comes with a huge privacy concern. The idea that someone can hear your voice without your knowledge is unsettling for most people. Stalkers, scammers, or anyone with bad intentions could use it to gather intel for social engineering, identity theft, or other malicious purposes. Hearing someone's voice, learning their habits, or even just confirming their identity without their consent crosses a line for many. So, use Spy Dialer with extreme caution, and only for ethical, legitimate purposes. Always consider the impact on privacy and legality. Spy Dialer blurs the line between clever investigation and digital eavesdropping, making it a double-edged sword in the world of information gathering. The power is real, but so are the risks. Use wisely and always remember, with great access comes great responsibility. Onward. Now the master key, OSINT framework. It's not a tool, but a map. An interactive mind map of every OSINT resource out there. Click telephone number, and you'll see dozens of free and paid tools for investigation. It organizes your search, showing you every angle, reverse lookups, voicemail, carrier info, and more. If one tool fails, pick another from the list, it's constantly updated by the community, so you're never stuck. The real shock? Seeing just how many ways your data can be accessed. The digital world is full of open doors, if you know where to look. Social Searcher is a real-time social media search engine. Type in a phone number, and it scans dozens of platforms, blogs, forums, and news sites for public mentions. You might find a number in an old forum post, a marketplace listing, or a blog comment, sometimes with usernames or extra clues. It's about finding digital breadcrumbs people forgot they left. You can even set up alerts for future mentions. It's a passive monitoring tool, great for ongoing investigations. The dark side, the internet never forgets. A number posted years ago can resurface instantly, linking your current identity to old forgotten posts. It's a lesson in digital hygiene. Think before you post, your past is just a search away. Let's keep going. Phone and Foga is for the pros, a command line tool for deep phone number reconnaissance. Run it from your terminal and it checks country, carrier, line type, and validity. It scans social media, data breaches, and more, automating dozens of queries at once. The output is raw, detailed, and fast. You can even plug in your own API keys for deeper results. It's a huge time saver for investigators, but it's also used by hackers for phishing and social engineering. The same tool that helps you secure your data can be used against you. Phone and Foga is a reminder. Your digital footprint is bigger than you think. Use it ethically and know what's possible. Next up. White Pages is the classic, now online. Enter a number and you might get a name, city, state, and sometimes age range. It's based on public records, so it's often more reliable for landlines. For mobile numbers, results vary, but it's still a solid data point. The free version is limited, but a name and location can narrow your search fast. The dark side? It makes snooping easy. What once took a trip to the courthouse now takes seconds online. Your public records are just a click away. Convenience comes at the cost of privacy, let's move on. Don't overlook Facebook's search bar. For years, you could type a phone number and go straight to the linked profile. Sometimes you still can, if privacy settings are lax. Many people never updated their settings, 
so their profiles are still searchable by number. Instantly, you get names, photos, friends, and more. Even if the direct search fails, use clues from other tools, like a name or city, to find the right profile. Facebook is the world's largest voluntary intelligence database. The real shock? Even if you never joined, your info might be there, uploaded by friends syncing contacts. Your digital shadow is bigger than you think. Next tool, never underestimate Google. Type a phone number in quotes and you might find old forum posts, business listings, resumes, or even PDFs with your info. Use advanced search operators. Combine the number with a name, city, or keyword for better results. Google's reach is vast. It's often the fastest way to uncover digital breadcrumbs. The dark side? Google reveals your digital exhaust. Every careless post, every public listing, every forgotten comment. Once info is online, it's there forever, waiting for the right search. Your past is just a query away. Google is the ultimate digital archive. Start every investigation here. Let's wrap up. 10 free tools, one phone number, an entire digital life exposed. The goal isn't to make you a spy, but to show how vulnerable we all are. Your phone number is a key. Protect it. Check your privacy settings, think before you post, and understand your digital footprint. Use this knowledge ethically for security and awareness. If you want more on cybersecurity and digital privacy, subscribe to CyberNexia. Stay safe, stay secure, and see you next time.